Hello Aries, it's my lady from my lady's way tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of July 8th through the 15th, 2019. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Alright guys, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Aries? Aries, Aries, Aries. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. All right, so we got the beauty card here. So this makes me feel like somebody is feeling they self right now, okay? Uh, which is awesome. It seems like somebody know what they were. If I do feel like somebody... It's just trying to be right, trying to be honest, um, or just being right and honest, okay? All right, yes, trying to be right and trying to be honest. So it seems like some secrets are getting ready to come out, and I do feel like the Aries is going to uh, admit, okay, or they're going to let their secrets out. Okay. All right, so I do feel like somebody may be dealing with someone uh, from a different race, religion, uh, just some kind of social difference, class, uh, whatever. I feel like somebody's dealing with somebody different, and I feel like it's getting ready to come out. The secret is getting ready to come out, okay? So I feel like somebody could be secretly dating someone, and now it's just like, oh, this is how I feel about it, so I'm letting it come out. Or it's coming out, and somebody's just going to be like, yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so I do feel like um, this could be the other way around, too. I do feel like the Aries cares about this person. But I do feel like this person um, is deeply in love with the Aries, okay? And I feel like that's why everything is getting ready to come out. Somebody's about to announce something. And the Aries just going to be like, okay, yeah. All right, but I do feel like this person makes the Aries feel good, but the Aries is on a, a like a 80 out of 100, and then the person the, per, the Aries is thinking about or with is on like a 206, okay? So, <clears throat> uh, the care that the other person has is blowing them out the water. Okay, so with this card here, I'm feeling like it could be anything from class, and then I keep hearing... same sex okay so i feel like in some uh situations the same sex but i do feel like whatever this is it's been a secret because it's not socially um cared about that much okay of course i don't have any issues with it but i do feel like whatever this is is it's something socially abnormal okay but it's like uh it's like that to this family, to these families. And I do feel like it's coming out, and I feel like the Aries is going to admit it, okay? Or this could be the Aries busting out like, hey, this is me, I love you, I want to be with you, blah, 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 whatever. And the other person Aries is with is just like, okay, yeah, let's well, say it, I'll, I'll admit it, okay? So it's like, you make me feel good, I like you enough, I love you a lot, um, but if you want to do this, go ahead. All right, we're going to see what that is. All right, so it's crazy. As everybody knew, everybody already knew. It's just like a, everybody had a feeling um, that this was going on. You had a feeling that this person was going to do this or this person had a feeling you was going to do this. And, I mean, it just happened. Okay, secrets came out. I do feel like, of course, the love is still going to be there, uh, but I, it's on the outside more than the inside okay of course there's always one person that loves more than another all right so i do feel like somebody has been holding this back somebody didn't want to say anything about this somebody didn't want to say how they feel didn't want to tell anybody for a long time uh of who this person is they were liking and dating and i feel like now it's just like a all right i'm ready to ready to let this out Okay, but I do feel like somebody really don't want to, but I do feel like they're going to do it. I do feel like they're going to do it. All right. 
It's like it's already out. I like you. I love you some, you know, and I don't want to deny this, you know, because you do make me feel good. All right, so we got the present card reverse. Okay, so I feel like, of course, this was a surprise, but it was an unpleasant surprise, okay? So it was just like, a, okay, this is out, you know, I do love you. You know, I wasn't ready for this, but I'm going to be ready for this, okay, for us, all right? And I feel like by, I'm going to just say the Aries, it could be the other way around, by the Aries admitting that this relationship is real, um, I do feel like it's, it's going to be a present to the person that loves 206, okay? I don't know why I'm calling the person 206. I don't know what that is or even what that means. All right, so we got this Atlantis card here, and this makes me feel like if this didn't happen, it's getting ready to happen pretty, 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 pretty soon, okay? Pretty soon, okay? But only thing I'm feeling like is, of course, we got the family members that are going to be in this situation, and I do feel like they're going to try to tear the walls down, okay? So, of course, let it out, but then close it up. All right, so I do feel like somebody is already emotionally exhausted. I feel like both people are emotionally exhausted uh, by this situation. I do feel like one person is feeling like pushed, but I love you enough to do it. And I feel like the other person is just like so happy with joy that they want to come out to the world. All right. All right, let's go. What's going on with the Aries? What's going on with the Aries? Wow. Okay, so I do feel like some of you guys are um, being watched. Okay. Um, I feel like you. some of you guys are successful and you are being watched. So I don't know what that means or what that is for. Aries. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? And it could be some people are just trying to watch to see if you guys are going to be successful, okay? <clears throat> All right, so we got the seven of wands uh, reversed here. So, of course, I feel like somebody doesn't have to fight anymore, and I feel like that's fighting to keep this relationship a secret, okay? Don't have to fight anymore. All right, so it seems like there was some kind of heart ache in the past. I do feel like you guys are getting over this, getting over it. All right, so definitely going to be a tower moment here. Everything is getting ready to be ripped down and started over um, ever since uh, you guys are coming out and telling everybody that you're going to be together, even though you're a different race, even though you're a different culture, religion, you know, same sex or whatever to case may be. I do feel like it's just like, forget what the world says. I love you. I know we're going to lose some stuff. I know we're going to win some stuff, but let's, let's do this. Okay. All right. So we got the seven of swords reversed here. Mm. This makes me feel like, of course you got somebody sneaky, um, sneaky around. Oh, goodness. Okay, so I'm getting two stories here. One story, I do feel like when everything's come crashing down, I do feel like the Aries may run. I do feel like the Aries may run. That's one thing I feel. The second thing I feel is... I do feel like somebody in your group that's trying to act like they're cool with you is getting information and I feel like they want to tear the place back down. They want to tear the relationship back up. Okay. Okay, but I've already said that friends beware of the friends and the family um cuz they're acting like they're there for you, the ones that are acting like you're there for. You can tell. You can look in their eyes. Just turn around unexpectedly and look at their face and that is going to show you who's really there for you okay because you do got a snake you got a snake trying to ruin everything okay but i do feel like some of you aries can't take the pressure and i do feel like somebody's going to admit it but then i think they're going to run all right i was feeling this earlier um 
I feel like the running part, somebody probably already ran and came back, restarted the relationship, okay? Um, some of you guys already just ran, so you don't know if this person is coming back. Um, but I was here in marriage earlier, so I do feel like some kind of marriage, some kind of proposal, and I feel like this is what is going to heal or what has healed the situation. It's just like, I don't care what anybody else says. I don't care what somebody is threatening me with. This is what I want. This is, you are what I love, and this is what I'm going to have, okay? I don't care if I got nothing as long as I got you. Um, so we have the eight of <coughs> sorry, I tried to hold that in. We got the eight of swords reversed here. So I do feel like somebody was trapped. Somebody was trapped with the thought of everything being broken down, of um being cut out wheels and uh, being tr trust getting cut off and stuff, but I do feel like once it finally happens, somebody just don't care. Like, I don't care. You know, I got the person I love. You know, I don't. I don't care if I'm broke, living under a bridge in a in a box or in, in a brick box or whatever the heck. I don't care if I got to fight for myself as long as I can be with the person I love. I do feel like somebody ran at first though. Okay, but I do feel like this person that ran is coming back. But beware of fake friend, family members, okay? They come in to tear you down. So look at those eyes. Look at those eyes, unexpected. Maybe kiss in front of them and see the, the facial reactions, okay? Um, <clears throat> so I do feel like when you come back, somebody ran, come back, I do feel like they're going to be happy. Okay, I do feel like they're gonna be happy, but <clears throat> sorry, but I also feel like with this tower card here, somebody is watching that happiness, and I do feel like they they first they envy it, and then I feel like on the other hand, they want to make it disappear. Okay, so beware and watch those eyes. Mm -hmm -hmm. Lovely. So we have the nine of pentacles here, so this makes me feel like, of course. Um, I do feel like you guys are going to build together. I do feel like you guys are going to be able to make a beautiful life. And then I do feel like this is going to last a while. Okay. A while to me is at least nine months. Okay. I'm different. Uh, but this could be nine months, nine years, but I feel like it's going to be a long time. As long as you let, um, don't let negative influences come in on you. Okay. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon and rising signs. Thanks for watching.